Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another Tuesday in Red Dead Online, and welcome back to the May event here for the game. Today on the show, we will be going over all of the observable changes for this monthly event, all of the obvious bonuses, the discounts we have, the free rewards, the free outfit, and even some more stuff coming later on this month. And so as we get started, if you enjoy this video at any point, or if you just find it helpful, let me know by dropping a like on it. And if you want to stay up to date with everything Red Dead Redemption 2 and Red Dead Online, then please consider hitting that subscribe button with your bell notifications turned on. When it comes to all of our bonuses in game this month, we have double gold, double money, and double XP on all legendary and infamous bounties. We have triple money and triple XP on the Day of Reckoning and Manhunt Bounty Hunter free roam events, which require the Bounty Hunter role to participate in. We have double money, gold, and XP on the most wanted and last stand. So just head over to Featured Series and you're going to be good to go. We have double money, double gold, and double XP on Call to Arms this month. Again, so usually Call to Arms has some sort of bonus and we're getting all three this month. And we also have double gold, double money, and double XP on the Il Sovrano Diamond Blood Money opportunity. And that sort of leads us into our gold bar discount for this month as well, because this is a Bounty Hunter Focus Month. You could take five gold bars off the prestigious Bounty Hunter license here in game this month, which is pretty awesome as well. When it comes to all of our discounts, we have a deal for 40% off the sniper rifles in this game. So the rolling block is discounted from $411 now to $246. Same with the Carcano, 40% off. It's now now worth $273 instead of $456. But on top of that, all ammunition is going to be discounted this month as well. So 40% off all regular ammo, 40% off high velocity, and 40% off express ammunition here. So that's pretty sweet. In addition to that, we have the bolus on discount this month. It's not only the standard bolus that's going to be 40% off, but that also includes the Hawksmith the Brookstone, and the Gravesend Bolus that you're going to be able to get at the fence. Don't forget to customize your Lamat Revolver at a gunsmith this week, because we also have an opportunity for 40% off the prestigious Bounty Hunter variant of the Lamat Revolver, as you can see right here. Absolutely beautiful. 12 gold bars instead of 21 gold bars this month. When it comes to our stable discounts, it's a little bit of an interesting month because typically we have a horse discount and when we have a roll on bonus and on discount, the roll horse associated with that roll is also on discount. But this month, we just have a couple discounts here. We have actually one opportunity for 30% off the Bounty Hunter Wagon. And along with that, if you were able to obtain your Bounty Hunter Wagon and you wanted to get some different re sprays and livery options for this and tint options, your Bounty Hunter liveries here are going to be 50% off. So that's pretty cool. You can get 50% off every single one of these, including all of the gold bar ones, which, you know, imagine dropping 10 gold bars on one of these. I went for the blue one because I just like the color blue. At Gus's shops located around the map, since ammo is discounted, we also have the Nitro Express cartridges on discount. We already discussed other ammo, like standard rifle ammo, stuff like that, but varmint ammo and arrows are also discounted too. At the fence, you can also get the standard bolus at the gunsmith, but we have a discount on the Hawk Moth bolus, the Brookstone bolus, the flammable moonshine is actually discounted here at the fence too, which is pretty interesting. The standard bolus is discounted. Dynamite is discounted. I guess flammable moonshine and dynamite, fire bottles, throwing knives, hatchets, cleavers, tomahawks. Those are all counting as weapons here. Or sorry, ammunition, which is quite interesting because, because they're usable types of ammo, I guess. You know, you could throw all these, so they are counting as like consumables in the ammunition category. Kind of interesting in my opinion. The Hunter Hatchet, the Ancient Tomahawk, those are on discount too. Standard Moonshine, since you can't actually do anything with it, like flammable moonshine, uh, besides just drink it, that doesn't count as ammunition, so it's not discounted funny enough. And then I don't think we're gonna have any other discounts here on this page, but I just wanna make sure, and it seems that we're good to go. For this month's free outfit, we have the following unlocks, clothing and items here available for free this month. We have the Hinksman hat, the Patterned Bandana, the Valdez Vest, the Union Suit for male characters or the Wide Collar Shirtwaist for females, the Bandito Pants, the Workman's Gloves, as well as the Hardy Boots and the Espinal Double Bandolier 
for free to make this outfit. You can just get and unlock and basically redeem every single one of those clothing items for free. Just head on over to a general store and basically find the discounted version of all these items. They're gonna show that they're zero dollars or zero cents. Just highlight that, find the colorway, and you can unlock that specific colorway of each clothing item for free, and you get this pretty awesome outfit. But just checking out this outfit here, I dig it. It definitely, this is like a classic outfit that I would be wearing in this game. I'd probably rock some sort of um, coat as well with this maybe, but I dig this. This is, you could wear this out in New Austin, you know, or out by Tumbleweed or Armadillo and look pretty sick in my opinion. I never thought of using the, uh, the Union suit as my shirt here. Us usually I'm going to use something like the Lotnip shirt or the Frumpy shirt. But I could also use this as well. I just made an outfit with the Hinksman hat a couple weeks ago. Um, same with an outfit with the Bandito pants. I love the Espinol double bandoliers. I love the Valdez vest, but the Morales vest may look honestly even better with this outfit. Either way, though, this guy did a fantastic job with it. Rockstar, thank you for featuring it. And uh, yeah, this is definitely a sick outfit here this month. And the Hinksman hat is normally six gold bars, so you definitely got to steal with that. Not only that, but we have some free rewards we're going to be talking about for the week of this week, May the 2nd through the 8th. If you complete any three bounties this week, you will receive the Blue Water Marsh Treasure Map. For the week of May 9th through the 15th, if you complete an infamous bounty, you will receive the white and black pair of the Arc Right Gloves. All bounty hunters who are at level five or above will receive a care package consisting of 20 poison arrows, 20 poison throwing knives, 100 express repeater ammo, and 100 express rifle ammo. We also have a reward for all players who reach low honor. They're going to receive the Hush Your Mouth emote. We have double Bounty Hunter experience rewards for trading in roll XP for gold at or above rank 30. That is basically here. If you go to your awards section, you can reset this one challenge. You normally get 50 gold nuggets as well as $100. But now with this being two times, two times rewards, every 10,000 Bounty Hunter XP you traded in and reset. As you can see in the bottom right, you're going to be getting one gold bar and $200. So that's pretty awesome there as well. All players who complete the Day of Reckoning free roam event anytime this month will receive a light blue pair of the Penstock Pants for male characters or the silver and black Hollyfield Bloomers for female characters. And if you finish around a manhunt between the week of May 23rd through the 29th, you will earn the silver and brown Palma hat and a reward to reset your bounty as well to get some extra cash and gold there. That's everything so far with the May event here in Red Dead Online. Of course, stay tuned for my next upload on the channel of us covering all of the free rewards, items, and more coming to the game each week this month. We'll also get our featured series event schedule with all of its subsequent bonuses and any other information, news, and intel that you need to know about. Along with that, we'll have our standard money guide for the May event. Same with the buyer's guide here, so you can stay up to date on all the latest intel on how you can come out on top of the event this month, because we have some really good bonuses and discounts that I definitely don't want players to miss out on here. But with all that said, hopefully you all enjoyed the video here today. And if you did, hopefully I earned your like on it. And of course, if you are new to my channel and you want to stay up to date with all the best Red Dead Online and Rockstar Games content, then please consider hitting that subscribe button so you don't miss out on a single thing we post here on the channel. We consistently talk about updates, news, information, tips, tricks, and even leaks, and we'll keep you guys updated here on the channel daily. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to follow me over on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram, those are the best places to get connected with me outside of YouTube, and you're more than welcome to ask many questions on those platforms. You can follow me at Hazardous HTTV, and all of my social media links can be found in the description down below. With all that being said, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all have a fantastic day, and I will see you guys in the next Red Dead Online video. Adios, amigos.